burn little holes in them. The poor fellow last night kept trying to see if his fly was undone. All right, I'll stop scrutinizing. The opening stage production for the 2012 season at Fort Edmonton Park's Capitol Theater was a success. And much like Neil Simon's Chapter 2, Fort Edmonton Park is turning the page on what they offer visitors who are looking for that little something extra on their journey back in time. And those involved are taking notice. Do I have to live out my life with your fancy? It's great. It's a beautiful new theater. And it's really, it's nice to be in a theater that has such history to it. You know, I mean, I know it's not the literal one that was here, but we get to, we've learned a little bit about the history of the theater and things like that. And it's just a beautiful new space and it's beautiful for the, for the audience to come and enjoy the show. As you can see around, it's just... You know, you don't. There's no other theater in, in Edmonton like this. Absolutely. Well, and you mentioned it. It, it isn't the original, but uh, the, the new technologies make it very comfortable and a very nice uh, atmosphere for audiences. Yeah, it's nice to actually work in in, in a space this size as well. Um, yeah. I've worked a lot, a lot, you know, but in independent theater, fringe theater, all that kind of stuff. And sometimes you just don't get uh, the 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 space, the the, the the acoustics, the kind of things that you do with a theater like this. And it's and it also it does kind of make it it makes it a little bit easier to. To, uh, to be in something that uh, is set in the past. Fort Edmonton Park is Canada's largest living history park with many attractions throughout the summer months. Each season, the facility looks for ways to draw in more visitors, in particular, the Selkirk Hotel. We do a, a fair bit of murder mysteries here at the hotel where we host a dinner. Uh, we uh, have a third party company who comes in and they host a murder throughout the hotel. Um, we have a, a combination with the dinner theaters as well going out through the summer. Uh, we do special event brunches here, Mother's Day uh, brunch, Easter brunch, Father's Day buffet. Fort Edmonton Park is very unique, very different. Uh, it's uh, within the city, you know, you don't have to go out of town to, to do something different and that's what we try and do is we offer unique opportunities for people to come and enjoy what we have here, the hotel and our surroundings in Fort Edmonton Park. There's a lot to offer. It's a relationship that was truly meant to be. You got the Hotel Selkirk right here and the Capitol Theatre just behind me. So close in proximity, it's a match made in heaven and the businesses are doing very well. They're getting a lot of people coming through these doors since they opened their doors over a year ago. It's a nice connection, right? You can come in and do uh, dinner at the hotel, uh, have a nice meal and then uh, run over to the Capitol Theatre for live theatre, so it's a great opportunity for us. That's great. So tell us, uh, on a business standpoint, how it's uh, been effective uh, for the past year. You had a chance to test it out. Uh, a lot of people showing up? Yeah, people are enjoying it. We did some live theatre last year, so that was our first year doing the live theatre and the dinners. Uh, very well received. People really enjoyed uh, the, the Capitol Theatre. is beautiful. The hotel is gorgeous. Uh, it's a very themed uh, atmosphere, so people are looking for something different to do. And that's what Fort Edmonton Park, Hotel Selkirk, and the Capitol Theatre can offer. And we're always looking for something new, even if it's old. Brad Kelly, Shaw TV, Capital Region.